What's up, guys? Another board here with more Endless Legend for you, Episode 3. Um, back from reformatting my machine, and I'm sure you can tell right off the bat, this is not the same save we left, because I backed up the whole Endless Legend folder, and the saves were not there. In Steam, they don't save the saves in the game folder, which they save it in some special spot, but I don't understand that. But anyway, also none of my saves were saved to the Steam Cloud. So, what I did is just played up to turn 40, uh, since we already did that, and I didn't want to do it. The, the first part is a little bit boring, so I didn't want to do that o over again. So it's slightly different here. I have two cities, two regions, but one guy started in a region right next to me, and I think that's a city. Yeah, that's a city right there. So very, very close. Um, I have three heroes. I have uh, one guy here, Feeder on Bones, uh, Feeds on Bones. This guy is, I'm actually leveling as a city dude. If you look at his skill tree, he's gonna. This is where I'm gonna basically build units, and has 24% unit cost reduction on the city. Um, and then I've got one guy over here. He's gonna be an army uh, general, but right now I'm just using him in here to level. But if you look at his tree, I'm gonna go up some defense and some army stuff over here. Um, but this is a really good city. This is my second city here. It's ridiculous. I've never seen a city like this. Um, a starting city anyway, and uh, here's my original starter city also very good um, Really got lucky with placement here a couple of great um, Regions and what I'm gonna do my plan is to get this smaller region and then get this region here because they, there's there are haunts over here There are three of them if I get all three of these haunts then that'll give me 15% science on all cities So that's definitely worth grabbing haunts. I love haunts for that reason um, right now I got my main army all nice and pumped up over here. I've learned my lesson. I got three flyers upgraded to level three. This is the third time I've updated them. They have tier two gear, very beastly, and a new hero. He actually has does not have any combat experience at all. Um, but this is my army, my main army here. And over here, I'm also building a secondary arm, army. I already have one guy popping out, and I have three more dudes coming out here. So pretty far into the game, at least a little further than last time. The first era is almost done as far as tech tree because um, I have some pretty amazing cities and uh, that's pretty much all you need to know for now. So let's get into it. I just did um, Empire Plan. I got 20% unit cost reduction and then 20% science. Um, so I'm doing pretty good there. And my money coming in is doing pretty good actually as well because even though I had three heroes and stuff because my cities are pretty beast. So what I'm going to do is take these guys out. They're, they're sending out roamers, as you can see here. And that makes it hard for armies to move around. These guys haven't been messing with me too much. But I've got a lot of stuff to clear out. So let's get to it. Unfortunately, this hero can only move two. I need to upgrade him with a piece of, of gear to for move uh, spaces. But see... Oh, actually, maybe that was just during winter. Winter just came and left. Oh, okay, yeah, he's got four now. Winter has come and gone, so I think it was because during winter, he only had two spaces. So I'm going to move over to here. Now this should be a no-brainer, but it's been known to happen that I would lose this. But with this many guys, okay, it's obvious I'm going to win. I w if it's if it's a, almost a tie, I'm going to start doing uh, manual. Because uh, I think I can maneuver my troops better than, than, the, uh, than the computer can. But for this, I'm going to do auto... And boom, no problem. Now these guys got hurt. I need to wait, and so did my hero. Uh, look at his life, though. 200, nice, huh? I need to wait until these guys are fully healed before I attack another village. But I want to get rid of these villages that are creating roamers here. Really should attack this guy's city, since he probably doesn't have two. Okay, so we've got one more move point. Let's set this guy up to take over. Which city's next here? Probably this city. But I might want to scroll down or stroll down this direction and start hitting these guys. Um, and let this new army hit that. That's probably what I'll do. Mm, now nah, let's come over here. These guys are going to be a pain. Well, actually, we still have these guys to deal with. So let's just do this. Okay, so good fight there. Very good. Uh, select minor faction. No, I don't. Well, I'd have to assimilate them. I don't want them. Plus vision for pacified. That's good, but it's not that great. They do have a ranged unit. That's kind of nice. I don't have any ranged units so far. Um, fight went well. Dismiss. This looks good. Okay, it's going to fade away anyway. Okay, so that was turn 40. 
pretty soon I want to get another settler and move over to here. This is not a great region. Um, it's not fully explored yet. Well, actually it is. There's only a few more spots to explore, but it's not very good. I can't find a really great spot to put a city. It's probably this spot right here. I'd probably plant right there, I would say. It'll also give me access to boats, which would be nice. Um, that's probably where I'll plant. That would also be good because of more science, but less food. So, I don't know. It's also more production, so I probably will go there. I'll probably plant right there. And then I'll move over into, into the region with haunts. Okay. In turn 40. So, I think we're doing a lot better than the original, um, the original two episodes. Uh, and that's not why, you know, people are going to be like, oh, conspiracy theory, yeah, he just ditched that save because it was crap. No, dude, I don't do that. I don't, I don't care if I start out crappy. Um, I generally just stick with whatever I've got and try to learn the game as I go. Um, but, you know, hey, lost the save. Luckily, I got some good regions right off the bat, so this is all good. Um, I already ended turn 40. What are you doing? Oh, apply it? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Apply it. I thought I already did that, but... Okay. Alright, so... I'm trying to think if I want... two. I think two armies will be good for now. I'm going to have a lot of space to, to cover. So that could be a challenge, but I think two armies will do it for now. Let's move over to here. Well, it's going to make it hard to attack those guys. Let's go to here. We need to get rid of these dudes. I don't know what happens when they stand on your area, but I don't think it's good. It can't can't be good. So what do we got here? Population's grown to five. So okay, that's good. That's exactly how I want it. I need to get um, some titanium and uh, glass steel extractors going, but I have not done that yet. I've been kind of pumping my cities up, and when you build four units in a row like that, your city gets a little behind. Um, oh, here we got more guys right here, and that's okay. I don't mind my cities getting a little behind because you definitely need armies, right? So this guy's not building anything. Titanium extractor or wine extractor? Probably titanium because I need to be able to upgrade my troops and stuff. Sewer system, mm, they're still happy. They don't really need that. But if I build on streets or whatever, like a borough street, then I could expand and I can get more influence points. But there's really nowhere to expand to that I really want to... Well, I kind of want to get that science. It's not a huge deal to me now. Because my influence... It's doing okay. It's not doing great. But it's doing okay. Hmm, wine extractor. Plus one wine on city. So... I don't think I have wine now. I wanted to see... Oh, I do. Okay, so what does wine do? 30 on cities? Mmm. It's alright. Doesn't seem like it's that good of a... You know what? Let's do this. We're going to build um, a burrow. What's this? What else does this do? Oh, one... Also one additional... Um, um, influence. So that's good. But I think a burrow is better. It's going to help me expand a lot more. And then I'll probably build a settler, I guess. So I'm going to go... No, that's not good. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to watch to see if I've got errors. So there was an error just then. Hold on a second. Let me try to re re uh, recoup this. Okay, well, I guess no errors were captured. I don't even know if that was an error, but it definitely hung, just like it usually does. Really, we need to capture those errors, man. Okay. So what was I talking about here? Never rest is gaining enough experience. Okay, so let's go to this guy. This is my, um... This... Never rests. Isn't that this guy? Let's look. Yeah, okay, so this guy is going to be doing, um... Army. So he's going to go plus the two defense. Then we're going to go 25 life on units. Then we're going to go experience per unit. So as they walk around, they'll gain experience. It's cool. Okay. So Rothold, my main city, has built the cool thing I told them to build. Mm, I think I need to do a settler now. I think it's time. Really need that third city. You know what? I'll wait till my second army's up because I, I want to make sure I can protect them. And this other guy's not gonna be able to do it. He's gonna be taking care of these other guys for a little bit, a little while anyway. 
Um, we're going to go with Burrow. That's what I was going to do, and I can't remember where I was going to put it. I kind of want to go this direction because I can get that science. But look at this over here. Let's let's escape out of that. Look at this over here. Right? River. And there's some nice tiles here. And there's science tiles. Wow, there's a bunch of them. So let's expand this direction. We can probably go up around here. Now those are nice tiles right there. Plus it'll, well, it won't matter if it cuts them off or not because you can't expand over, over a regional border. Okay, so. I think we're going to go... If we go here, we'll get these. If we go there, we'll get these. Which one would be better? Probably these. Okay, so we're going to go like this. Build that. We do need titanium, though. We need that building up. Let's do titanium extractor first. Let's let's take this off. Let's do it. Yeah, we need to start building that up. Hold on. Because we're going to want that on later in the game, and we're going to want that built up. So let's do it where we can control it good. Let's do also a glass deal. Which, where's that? Ah, right there. And then we'll do a wine extractor. Let's just get up this stuff built up because... Oh, cool. Yeah, right next to our base. Shouldn't take too long to get those. They're like one each. And then we'll do a burrow. That'll get us uh, some stuff coming in on the Empire here. Alright, so we're all good to go there. Who needs to move? Okay, this guy, let's get him in a fight. They're just about healed, so they should easily be able to kick these guys' butts. And since these guys are uh, pacified, they'll never generate any more units. No problems. Auto. And what it's doing, even though it hurts these guys, it's getting XP. See, they're all getting XP, which is great. And it's building up cadavers. Remember I told you about that? So if we go up here, we've got four out of eight cadavers now to get us a nice stockpile of food. Pretty soon we're going to need to build um, those sewer systems, though, to keep up our happiness. Okay, so butts have been kicked. More butts need to be kicked down here, so let's let's move this direction here. Alright. Turn 42, not doing too bad. Not doing too bad. Ah, see? Titanium? Yeah, this is this is good for us. Oh, it's not even up there yet, because I think it think it takes one turn. Units that leveled up. In the army? Oh, I thought they were level 3 already. Or level... Oh, they were level 1. That's right. Cool. That's awesome. Then they'll uh, get uh, be a lot stronger. I remember in Endless, Endless Space, it was a really good idea not to lose your troops. Keep them through the whole game, because it got ridiculously overpowered, basically. Alright, so we're going to come through here. I think we need to stomp those guys first. So let's move these guys into here. We need to protect our, our uh, new region here. Wow, look at all that science, man. And money. Damn. Oh, I'm going to get that. Oh, I know where I'm expanding. All right, so we are good to go. We should have another army up fairly soon. I'm surprised that guy hasn't leveled more. Ah, here we go. Empty belly. Empty belly, I think, is this guy. Let's go look to make sure. Yes, okay, so if this guy's leveling, that's great, because we're going to need him to be pretty uber by the time he gets his army. So... That is good. Good stuff, Empty Belly. <laughs> empty Belly. That guy's awesome. Oh, let's move a dude over. Boom. Let's get those guys out faster. What do we got over here? Uh, yep, time to move over. I think what I'm going to do is 3-3 three, three and then start pumping science. That could be really good. Or maybe I should put one guy into, um, into uh, influence, because that's plus two, man. That'd be awesome. Maybe I'll do... No, I think I used to do it like this, right? That's probably better. It's only plus four. It's not a huge deal. I mean, they're already beast anyway. All right, let's come in here. Let's just bomb these guys into into last week. We should be good. Everybody's fairly healthy. Yeah, plus all these reinforcements. And it's going to get all these guys' experience, so this would be great. <laughs> these guys are going to get smashed. If anybody dies, they're horrible. Yeah, nobody dies. And everybody gets a little bit of XP. I think they split it to everybody. And two more cadavers. That's awesome. Oh, and I just finished my first quest. He who meddles, leader of Breakaway Necrophage Hive, must feed his people. To do so, he has chosen to attack minor factions. <laughs> 80 dust. Sweet, sweet flesh. Oh, this is where... Okay. 
this dude said, okay, search your unspoiled ruins after gathering 10 titanium and 20 of dye. Okay, so I need to, I need to get those dye extractors up. I get 25 emeralds, so that works for me. And there it is right there. Usually not very far away. Can I search it now? Yeah. Please come back when you finish the quest, dummy. Okay, no problem. This guy's no move points, so I think we're good. So, so far, very, very successful episode 3. Not too much crap happening. So that's good. Search party. Okay, keep going. Search up. I want to do that whole era. Good. My other guy leveled. Good. These guys are awesome now. So, I think their health is keeping up fairly well. Yeah, he's not hurt too much. They've got a lot of health because of those upgrades I gave them. So I think I can keep, keep continue attacking these dudes. And not, yeah, see, not be too worried. Okay, they've got some support, but so do we. Nobody die. Yes, okay. Little hurt. I probably need to, to chill now for a while. 10 XP, nice. And four cadavers. So, now I've got a stockpile. See? 120 food on city. I can just pump it into a, um, into a city. Okay. This is looking good so far. I've got one minor faction slot here. And I'm going to be using that for those haunts. Okay. So those guys are jacked up. Who else do we need to jack up? I think that I think just these two dudes down here, because they're going to keep producing units, and these guys over here, I just need to come out and just keep wiping these guys out. I'll probably move through here to make sure these haunts are dead. I'm not too concerned with these guys yet. Maybe army number two can kind of wipe these guys out. So I'm going to keep moving this direction. Let's see. There we go. And by the time they get over there, they should be fully healed, I think. All right. Almost 20 minutes into this episode, looking really good. A little bit over half here. Good. Wine extractor going strong. More units popping out. How many units we got over here now? One more unit to go, and then it's going to be time to create that second army there. Good. Very good. No trade routes. I, I'm still having a hard time with how do I get roads. Okay. So we're going to beeline it up to here. Let's see if I can see any. I'm sure there are roaming haunts in here. I need to be kind of careful. Since I'm a little bit hurt. Not too bad. So I'm going to approach a bit slowly. I'm going to come up to this ridge so that I can kind of see what's going on here. Let's come up to here first. Ah, see, there's three guys there. The haunts are pretty strong, too. I need to at least wait till I'm fully healed. Okay, well, this guy's fully healed. Wow, he's pretty beastly now. Hmm, okay. I'm gonna wait. Maybe they'll send their guy out and I'll get lucky. If I attack him far enough away, I can just attack him by himself. Usually when there's three, they'll send a guy out. But it could be because it's later in the game, and so they might not send a dude out. Okay, so... I got some new buildings here. 60% fortification. One militia slot. I think I'm going to go with the settler. Because... So let's see what this does to it. Two... Two. Okay, so that's not doing any good. Two. I mean, there's no point in putting extra dudes in this. If it, I mean, I'll, I don't get any food. And I can't produce this guy faster, so I might as well do this. We could do influence. I'm kind of low on influence. Let's do a little bit of influence. Okay, that's three. You can't do it. 47 science. Hmm, do I want influence? I think I'm good. I'm just going to go with Burroughs for influence here. All right, um, a little bit concerned still about these guys. Let's let this guy heal one more time. I cannot lose this army. I just can't. I can't lose this army. We've known. We know how detrimental it is losing an army like that. No more glitches. That's good. I'm watching the airlog right now. No airlogs coming up. But I think I have to do a refresh anyway. I won't see it pop up. At least is this guy fully healed now? Yep. Okay, they're fully healed. Oh, okay, I can walk right down, sweet. I'm just going to walk to here, and I'm going to hopefully kill these guys. They're pretty strong. Ah, still looking very good. Again, they have a support army. Man, that's bad. I'm going to lose somebody. Probably one guy is going to die. 
Nobody died. Nobody died. Very good. Okay. Five cadavers. I need to rest. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to chill out. If I see anybody coming, I'm just going to jam. Hmm. How am I going to do this? Okay. Alright, I'm just going to chill. Alright, someone's level 3. That's good. Never rests. Good. He's got, he just leveled. So let's get him something else. Life on units. Let's get that. That way my guys will be stronger. So now what are they at? Yeah, see, 241. That bumps them up quite a bit. So good, good. Now just relax, bro. You did get a good job. That was a hard fight, especially since they had support units. Alright, Settler's done. Now we can actually... Oh, see, these guys are getting uh, uppity here. So, science looking good. Let's put these guys back. I'm going to probably bring this army up to escort that settler. Too many guys roaming around still. Sewer system would not be bad on this dude now. Because right when I put this out, it's going to be a negative 10 on the city. I'm not sure. Let's see. Yeah, let's do sewer system. And then we're going to do... Stronghold. 60 city unit fortification. Right now this guy is at... What's he at? Doesn't say. Thought I knew. Oh, down here? Garrison? Nope. Doesn't, doesn't say. You have to get out of it, maybe? I thought it told you. I have two trade routes and I'm not doing anything with them. That sucks. Oh, maybe it's this. Maybe we can see it here. I cannot see it. Hmm. Why not? Where's the... Maybe if you click... It. Oh, here we go. 150. 150, um... Defense right now. So we're going to do this. We need to start expanding. We, we cannot wait. Let's expand to there. After we build a sewer system. Alright, so this guy... Let's make an army. Then I can smash that guy really fast. Okay, hold on a sec. There we go. I don't like clearing my throat on when I'm doing that. So, so new army. And we're going to unassign this dude. Go back to here. Unassign. Oh, nope. Unassign. Go to the academy. And then we're going to assign him to an... Nope, no, 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 nope. Assign you to an army. There we go. Now they're beast. Come over here. Show you what we're, how we roll. <laughs> You're so dead. All right. So I also should um, put some armor on this dude. I think I didn't do it with the other guy either. Let's do some tier two breastplate here, and let's do tier two. Let's do tier two everything. We need to bump this guy up like big time. Tier two weapon. Oh, we oh, we we're gonna add speed. Let's do that first. I think this is the speed one. Improved movement too. Boom. See, now they can move at the full speed, the whole army. Tier 2 shield. I wonder if I have enough money to upgrade both of these guys. Oh, yeah, I probably do. These, this is not costing too much here. So he's got all two tier stuff except the helmet, right? Now, when I used to try to add these things, it wouldn't work. But last time I did this, it worked. So great. All tier 2, 95. I can upgrade both of my armies. My generals. Boom. And it took the money. Good. Oh, I'm losing money. Need to be careful with that. So that guy's bumped up. Let's bump this guy up before he gets in a fight. He's hurt. Well, this guy's not hurt, but his, his dudes are. We want this. There we go. Some speed. Tier 2 everything. Beast this guy. I love this about the equipment. Now, hopefully later in the game, um, the e equipment gets a little bit better, because, or a little more differentiated, because it doesn't seem like it really does... They all, it all kind of does the same thing. It doesn't feel like there's an, there are enough options, really. Okay, so that 95... See, why won't that work? Oh, I'm not in the region I control. 
That's what it is. See, I'm, I'm outside of the region. So let's bring this guy back, because he does need the buff up here. And then let's put the settler with this guy. 20 die. Let's, let's put the settler with this guy here. New army. Oh, I can't. There is an army nearby, but not enough free slots. Okay. Should I drop a guy, or should I just have the settler follow us? He'll just follow. How fast does he move, anyway? Only four. Let's have him move ahead. Should we take this region first? I kind of feel like we should. Hey, there's an unspoiled ruins. Yeah, I feel like we should take this ru this area first, then plant down here. I haven't really looked here. This could be good. Well, that's all right. This is also decent. We'll, we'll look later. We're not we're not even close to ready for that. So, good fight there. Nice hundred million cadavers. Uh, now that this army's done, they're like, hey, we need something better to do. We're bored. Uh, these guys are really, really happy. So we're going to go with die extractor, because we need dyes, don't we? Let's click. Yeah, 20 dyes. So we're going to do a die extractor. And let's figure out where we're putting it here. Ah, right there. And then we need something to bring in more cash, because we're, like, hedging. We're really losing money fast. Military upkeep, that's why. Ooh, hero upkeep, too. Too many heroes. All right, so we're good. Turn 50. Doing good. No errors. That's what I like to see. No errors on my system. Die extractor. So one of these gives you, I thought, more money. Well, sewer system would be good because we get more approval. But city upkeep sucks. Take two turns. How long, how long would this take? Two turns. Let's do it. Let's do a burrow upgrade. Which direction do we want to go? Well, we want to go this way. So that's a no-brainer. Um, see, we only get two doing, doing that. But we get all that science. Hmm, I don't know. This is a t uh well no we don't need more science from this let's go with let's go with this all right we'll get that and then we're gonna get a sewer system because I think that's gonna make it so they don't really like us too much and here yeah they're getting a sewer system and then they're doing the burrows so that's actually worth it well worth it right there okay so I think we're good someone up you know, moved up that's good there it is again hold on let me stop the video hold on. Okay, well, no error was captured again, but you know what? That's the 30 minutes anyway. So here's the end of Episode 3, Endless Legend. Let me, guys, let me know what you guys think. I'm really loving this game, and I'm, I love my new save, I have to say. Um, it sucks I lost it. At least now I know if I have to reformat again because these drives do die, um, that I will know how to get the save. So we'll at least be able to keep this save. And this, I think, is a better save anyway. It's more interesting. I'm doing a little bit better. Um, a little more tactical and not so... Basically, the last one seemed like a wasteland to me. Most of the regions around me were pretty bad, but these are pretty decent. So anyway, again, let me know what you think about Endless Legend. Oh, and uh, sorry for all the new people here from the Endless Legend forums. Uh, really glad to have you around. If you could like and favorite and share this video, I'd really appreciate it. It helps the channel out a lot. And I will see you guys next time. Stay frosty.